Hello everybody! Welcome back to another Moody Mayor Diaries vlog and today we are course walking! And we're competing together! I know! I was thinking that today for the first time in so long we're competing together! I know! It's that so is so mentally! Exciting. Finally! Like, like my time has come! And everything! I know! Oh. Mm. Very exciting! Okay, these big massive jumps are giving me the actual fear! <laughs> and that's our last jump so let's not even think about that right now but that house! These are quite wide, eh? Yeah, they're I always quite wide at first. Find them quite wide. So we are here at Forester Seat Cross Country. Herbie's rearing to go. Come back. Ah! Um. And uh, <laughs> yeah, we're both doing the 80 Hunter Trail not pick a fence or anything so no. we've got no choice we don't we don't have any choice to be fair i did have a choice at glen eagles but i didn't know about it so um it's best for me to not have a choice otherwise i'll just do the easy options yes, exactly. i will but um yeah so this is jade and i's second ever hunter trial sort of thing yeah so um yeah i'm a bit nervous to be honest and this is your first one back yeah first one back in ages oh, oh yeah Herbie first one for this year yeah um and so. i'm feeling good about it i've had a confidence knock with like show jumping and stuff but i'm still feeling good about cross country so yeah here's hoping it continues yeah tomorrow on we're to gonna tomorrow. be like oh, <laughs> both of us on the so, world this is jump number one a nice inviting log herbie's way to trip joanna up again um <laughs> Sorry. Um, yeah, so I'm always happy when there's like a nice wee log like this. One, eh? I know, yeah, I love it. Really good. Even when Jake Bell and I did this course, we did that one, so that's good to know. It was a pick offence. We did a lot of like 50 centimeter goals. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and we just go over this hill, and there's number two peeking at us. Okay, this is number two. Herbie's serenading it. A nice wee. They're quite big. Yeah, they're. <laughs> the 90s they're massive, like. But, yeah, they're massively. Yeah, so. Go stand beside it. It kind of makes it look so small on camera, but they are quite chunky yeah, three things, it. aren't it's, they? It is always quite chunky here. Yeah, so we're just saying that the three first ones are quite plain because this course has quite a lot of bright jumps in it, which is a bit scary. But um, yeah. yeah. They're kind of like roll toppy sort of. Uh, yeah, small. quite inviting. This one doesn't freak me out. Okay, so we're through the gates, which is flagged. Why? <laughs> it's a bit random, eh? Yeah. Okay, and then we're over to these wee, like, what do they call these pheasant feeders or something like that? They're good, aren't they? Yeah, I think they are. Like, they put feed in it and the pheasants eat through the gaps. Who knew? Learn something new every day. Oh, God. That's embarrassing. So, yes, this is number four. Yeah, scared. Okay, so we have our first little combination. How many strides is between that? Like, two? Yeah. The little trees are kind of freaking me out a bit. They're quite, like, long. They kind of look like long stem broccoli. They're tall, aren't they? Yeah. Kind of making it a metre jump, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> don't say that. Nah, they, they don't worry me so much. They're okay. Really? I've never been so far. I think I'm going to stand Do you? Yeah, this one. No, I don't. Oh. I think I think number two the scariest so far. It's the chunkiest. So we've come from over there, it's quite a big walk and this is at like such a strange like oh my god the closer you get the steeper oh it is god. like the camber of it is just crazy off like it's not it's on a so flat ground weird. at all like that is so not scary and I don't like benches as it is like that freaks me out a little Hey, what the hell? go sit on that you'll fall off <laughs> grab it you'll take it right Herbie enough the massive drop that I've been scared of my entire existence so that's ideal the jumps are oh god it's flagged it's flagged ah! so this is jump number seven an angle again honestly why why are they doing it like this though that's quite a big chunk That is, that is so much freaking bigger. terrifying. That is so much bigger. Mm, 
I'm scared. We're going towards the wall. Okay, Joanna and I are just saying this is like a very difficult course. So we've just come off that one and we're having to like come all the way over here in like five strides. And there's like a wee like dog's leg combination, which is bloody scary. Okay, the nemesis is approaching. It's so funny, like, walking up to it from here, it doesn't look so bad at I all. know, it's massive from the other side. I was literally watching our vlog from when you did this. Yeah. And I was actually like, Ugh, on the other side, it's like a meter ten, the draw. It's humongous. Okay. Yeah, I swear, like that little one is like the height of the Glen Eagles one. And this one. I did that little bell, the green one. <laughs> oh no. So this is it from the other side. It doesn't look as big as it is, it's big. Joanna goes down beside it to prove my point. <laughs> Herbie's making friends. Yeah, so it's um oh gosh, it's a big drop. It's scary. Anyone who can do the biggest one literally is like an idol in my eyes. Herbie, no! You're not going in there, you've just had a bath. No! So, luckily for us, we just have to go through... My camera keeps defocusing. Yeah, so we don't have to go down any drops, um, just Herbie, straight through no. the water. And um, then this lovely little lilac one like is B. Boat. And this actually looks so chill compared to the rest of them so far, eh? Hey? the photos of this purple one, it looks massive. It's quite wide, but it's quite small. It is quite small in comparison to a lot of the yeah, ones we've seen. Like short in height, but it yeah. is wide. Like... Yeah. <laughs> it is wide. So this one's quite misleading because from the front it looks really chill, but when you get to the side of it, it's actually very wide. Yeah. Oh my god, it's so wide. No, heavy. Oh I know, but it's fine. It's so wide. Oh my god. It is so wide. I wonder if the other ones are like as wide as that and we just don't realise. Maybe. I don't know. Hmm. So then we've got this like ski slope thing and it's actually looking all right. I'm not oh, too worried about that one. Done. That's humongous. That is humongous. Mm. But yeah. I like how even like the tiny versions are like painted the exact same. And stuff. I know, they're really cute. They put in a lot of effort into their courses yeah, here. Courses are lovely but quite scary. Yeah. Right, so we've just came away from those like wee ski slope jumps and we literally could not find out where the other jumps were but Alas, they are down this very steep Wait, hill. Wait, see how steep this is? I'm gonna go down it. So yeah, go down it, please. I know, because it doesn't look it, but it really is. Oh my god, I'm actually gonna need to walk down this, or Blondie will fall over. Why falls? <laughs> <laughs> that is far. <laughs> right, so this is us at the bottom of the hill and we are feeling pretty uneasy about it. And at least then the jump afterwards is like one of the smallest ones, like Yeah. Like not white. Oh or the ground's like, a bit sugarly. Isn't it? Oh, oh god. Together. Right, so we've came up to the ditches and it's usually this one in the 80, which is like the most chillest thing in the world because the grass is literally like at the top of it. But we've got this chunker. So, yeah, I don't think either of us are feeling great about that. Joanna, you invented. And then after the ditch, we come up to this bus, which is fine. Claire's been nervous about it, but it's actually not any bigger or chunkier than like most of the jumps we've seen. So, we all good. Okay, so number 16 is one that I've always been a wee bit nervous of because it's got a ditch in front of it, but I was just saying to Claire, if we've came this far, then we're okay. Do you know, they're gonna do it. So this is the last jump and it's very chill compared to what we've seen so far. So, oh, if we come this far, I will be bloody happy. Oh my God. Good morning, everybody. I don't know if Joanna's done a similar intro where kind of <laughs> trying to figure it out as we go. She's doing an earlier class, well, an earlier time than I am. Um, so she's leaving a wee bit earlier. So I think she's probably at the yard now getting totally ready, but um, I'm away to leave because I don't want to miss her either. So I'm on at like the back 12 and she is, excuse my hands, by the way, look at that. I put like, you know, the tan moisturizer on my face to try and like give myself a wee bit of a, a glow. 
Honestly, I'd make a really bad girl. So yeah, Joanna's on at about 11.30, I think, and I'm on at about 12.30, so she needs to be there quite a bit earlier than I do. But um, I want to watch her, so I'm going to be there early. So yeah, I've um, got all my stuff packed. And how cool is this, by the way? Like, this has actually like made my nerves kind of feel a bit better because I was so nervous, but this has made me happy. Like, it's not like taking my nerves away, but it's made me happy. How cute! Is my GS equestrian hold all? Like, so I've not really been like away to much, like any big shows where I've needed a lot of stuff or anything recently. Um, but so today I was like, you know what, I'm gonna take my hold all. How cute is it? Um, and it literally fits everything in it, it's got everything in it my body protector, like everything, honestly, unreal game changer. So I'm gonna be having that with me literally like every single show now. <laughs> So yeah, I'm just about to leave. I think I've got everything. I hope I've got everything. Um, yeah, just try to breathe and chill out and try not to think about the jumps that I'm going to have to do because I am absolutely petrified, as you guys can imagine. Like, I didn't sleep that well last night. I was looking at the videos we took, like, just flicking through them, like, I don't know if I can do this, but, oh well, I've got to give, a, give it a go. Yeah, I am quite worried, I'm not going to lie, but we'll be fine. <laughs> Oh, I am pooping myself, like we're at the yard now, I'm just kind of kicking about, uh, waiting for a wheelbarrow to become free so I can muck out and I actually just feel sick, like I know what's coming. So like every minute that passes, it's like, it's like I'm going to do like a really big talk at uni, but worse because there's a risk of dying. You know what I mean? But like when you have to do a solo presentation and you're like, oh, like how do I get out of this? Do I just like run in front of a car, like break my leg? I don't know. It's not too far, but um, yeah, it's kind of how I feel. So um, I had nobody coming with me to groom today as Joanna's going like an hour earlier and she's got like all her family. So I've roped a very hungover CD into coming <laughs> <laughs> and grooming for me and helping give me a leggy up and stuff. Not sure how much help she will be, but she's brought cups of tea. So That's you've, already you've a good got start. a star already. <laughs> So I've been running around like a maniac this morning, um, just trying to sort the stables and everything before the competition. Um, but I'm already in my base layer, stables are done, Blondie is looking beautiful. Um, I can't wait to take off her Snuggie Hood boots and see her white legs from yesterday. I gave her like a full on bath day and everything. She looks stunning um, and her coat's starting to come through, which is really exciting. Um, but yeah, I'm feeling like pretty positive and um, just need to get hitched up now and be away in sort of like next 10 15 minutes or so um but yeah positive mindset i don't know if claire will be saying similar things to me this morning i highly doubt it um actually i just saw her not that long ago and she's kind of like freaking out and i was like have you tried to like not freak out <laughs> i don't think that worked um but yeah, so far so good, positive mindset, and yeah, we'll be on our way soon. So no turning back now. I don't actually know whether it's been mentioned in the vlog that me and Claire have traveled separately because Jade and Blondie are in love. So we thought if we had them here together and then had to like separate them, it would just be a bit hectic. So we've traveled separately and um, I'm here with Cameron. He looks very excited to be here. Say hello. Hello, people. the people. <laughs> so um, yeah, it's just us here just now. Claire will be coming along shortly. She's about an hour after me anyway, um, but she will arrive just before me so she can watch me. I hope she better. Um, and yeah, we've finally arrived and the car park is busy. It's definitely a busy day today. And this just gives me so much like summer vibes. A total like loaded car park, loads of horses, loads of cross country colours. Very, very exciting. And we're next to a horse that looks very, very like Blondie. <laughs> That's cute. Apart from it looks more Palomino, so I'm a bit jealous. See what I was saying about Blondie looking clean? Got a very, very white mane and white socks. And her tail's looking good. God, I feel like I've put in a lot of effort to try to make her look half decent for this show where looks don't even count. <laughs> but she looks pretty for photos at least. Hello, we've got Alicia in the back by the way. Hello. <laughs> That's us just arrived, we've been driving for about an hour and um, oh my God, it's busy. How busy is it? 
Oh, I am actually starting to have like genuine panic attacks internally, but um, I'm just gonna have to deal with it. I don't. I think maybe the biggest issue is when you see the the ambulances. But, um, <laughs> what did you think of that? <laughs> it doesn't fill you with huge amounts. I thought I was Joanna on the Palomino. Did you look? Like you'll see it. Okay, you might not see it. Yet, okay, you'll see it in a second, and you'll be like, God, like, look what? at everyone. I know it's frightening. Okay, so I, I just need to get a grip, to be honest, and breathe. It's going to be awesome. absolutely fine. Oh, um, I'm getting the thumbs up. <laughs> okay, look, there's another bloody paramedic. We are trying, uh, like... Maybe one day I'll be working these. That'd be funny. Yeah, do you know what? That's so true. I'll be, like, not missing out, really, because... Actually, shall I just park... Oh, I should have parked there. Oh, look, she's too distracted by the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, this car park is absolutely packed. Oh, that's Joanna's mum. V! V! <laughs> <laughs> we have met the gang. Say hello, Joanna, to the vlog. <laughs> okay, Joanna is uh, ready. Looking the part, very cute, obviously. Sticky bum needed, just in case. And Blondie's looking very cute as well with her lovely groom, Emma, with the iodine on her hands. Emma's been doing something. It looks like I've also been doing it. I <laughs> know! Laughing, but yeah, looking good and excited. Jade was like looking out of the door in the trailer, like, where are we? Really? Yeah. Oh my god, look at those two. I hope they don't see each other. Yeah, same. <laughs> and she's on. And she says she's excited, so that's really good. Happy days. I thought you said I recognise that horse. There's Fendals. Hi, Fendi. Would you mind helping put my girth up? Will I ever learn? And just start walking up myself. Earlier, oh God. I just had to run. Yes. Fuck. Freaking God. <laughs> I actually get TV when I'm... <laughs> oh, I hate it. <laughs> okay. There's a big rocky patch there, so... Easy. Well done! Woo! Trot there.
Oh my god, honestly, I actually felt emotional. I just, it's so overwhelming know, to watch, really eh? Was. Like, so good. I know, that's the thing. Like, after I was over jump number three, yeah. you just like. Get in the swing of it. Yeah, totally. Yeah, she was flying though. I know, we went far too fast. I, I was like, you're meant to trot now, you're meant to trot know, now before that like, ditch. Just, <laughs> you know what, she was having fun, so yeah. I was just like, yeah. be confident. Yeah, definitely. It's more important, but I'm eh? I'm so glad she's not like, with her having refused, like, the show jumps not yeah. a, two, a wee while ago. Yeah. Like, I'm so glad it's not like knocks her confidence. Definitely, like, yeah. She just needs like a hand from me sometimes to be like, Ooh, go. Fine, yeah. Yeah, yeah. go. So you went one hot handed over the ditch? I know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know why I did that. Yeah, you're just like, had the stick like. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Please. Oh, oh my god, so amazing. exciting. I know. So fun. Can we for next week? Okay, so obviously finished my round and got the goods. Me and Cameron are having some chips and cheese um, and I'm relishing, relishing? Is that a thing? Like, relishing in the fact, yeah, in the fact that I'm done and it was amazing and now I get to watch Claire. It's so much funner like watching somebody else without all the nerves and everything. So yeah, I've not seen her in a wee bit and I'm hoping that she's feeling, she did say she was feeling a little bit better um, since watching me. So fingers crossed. Bless this little baby, she's been so quiet since she's finished. <laughs> I think she, she absolutely loved it and now she's just like totally chilling. She's um, cooled right down, had water all over her, um, have her leg cooling gel and stuff. And yeah, she's relaxed. Offered her water, but she won't bloody drink. Hey baby. Oh, she will sleep well tonight. Little treats. Cameron, you didn't do her stretches beforehand. She didn't need it today. She said she was fine. Oh, she said she was fine. That's fine then. Fine. Oh, yeah. Sometimes she does her stretches herself, so Cammy doesn't need to Sit. actually help me with them. Sit. Not a dog? Sit. Oh, bless her. Is that nice, sweeties, baby? Oh, gorgeous, sweaty girl. Oh, it's so good. What time was it? <laughs> what time you were on? Uh, <laughs> it's. It's. Quarter two. Yeah, so perfect timing. Elegant, get on. Thank you so much. It's fine. Right, how are we feeling? I'm not very good. <laughs> Jay just shook her head at me like, oh hell no, what's mum saying about me? <laughs> no, you'll be totally fine. Yeah, we good. You're gonna have fun, aren't yeah. you? It's the first time I've jumped in this bit, actually. Are you joking? You're a risky business. <laughs> I've ridden in it quite a lot, though. Don't do that. Makes <laughs> sense. You're a crazy person. <laughs> She's excited. She's excited. She's like, let's go. Okay, I'm out on the course to watch Claire now. I'm just getting in position. I've got quite a few people, um, friends and family and stuff, dotted about the course, so we should get some good videos. Very excited. And from where I'm at, I can like see a lot of the jumps further away as well. It's always good when you get like a good view of everything. But you do worry about like where they are. <laughs> the happy horse. Um, you do worry about like where they are and like when they're coming and stuff, don't you? Good luck, have fun!
Yay! Well done, Claire. Second one. Well done. You're nearly done, you can do it. Go on. Go on. Go on. God, um, I am so happy. So um, she was unreal. She actually flew around the course. Like she flew around like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Like she did that bloody wall drop. I can't believe I did that. Um, and then we went into the water and she just lost all momentum. Like she was kind of like, oh, and then she felt very like, oh, sticky coming out the water. 
and we had like the worst line and like no momentum going into that wee purple jump which was one that didn't scare me which is funny um because she jumped but she was just a bit like okay bye like i'm not going over that one from this angle do you know what i mean so um i knew that was my fault like i was like Shh. like oh i buggered up so i turned around and uh did it again she went over it and then we kept going she had a wee look at that ditch jade shush and we look at the ditch and oh my god there's a horse trying to load oh. so oh she dropped her carrot um so yeah the ditch she had a wee like we've not practiced over ditches like at all so i was like bracing myself for that one and i just had to take my hand off give her a smack in the arse and she went over it so that's fine and um flew all the scary jumps that i was frightened of and then stopped ran out of the last jump which um well i was unexpected because I was like, blast jump, woo! And then I thought, I actually still need to keep my guard on. I still need to aim her and like, like actually have a nice line and a nice momentum going up to every single fence. It doesn't matter. Like, it's the first jump, the last jump, a non-scary jump, a very scary jump. Like, I just need to like, like take every fence and attack every fence. Do you know what I mean? So I learned that from last time that every fence, we still need to go, 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 go. We're still jumping. Do you know what I mean? So, so buzzing with her though. She actually felt so keen, like not even a wee bit backwards. So This is why we can't travel Blondie and Jade together because she's seen her now and now she's having a little hoolie. She's such a madam, honestly. She's like, give me my girlfriend. Shocking behaviour. Blondie Taylor. But she looks pretty. Right, I think it's maybe home time. <laughs> a little bit of an abrupt end to the day because Blondie's just totally like losing it because she can hear Jade now. Um, but overall, amazing day. Claire's obviously gonna update you on her half and we're just gonna head home because she deserves a little rest and some food and just chill. I mean, I still have everything on. I'm like, I can't breathe, I'm sweating. She's like, what you do? Oh, that is so nice. Take my body protector off. Yeah, Unzip it. Oh my god, it must be like one of the Victorians sat on their corsets or something. It's just like <laughs> at the end of the day, letting everything hang loose. But um, yeah, we're stopping now to get some food and some juice because that I am was thirsty. Work yeah, that was. Yeah. That was. Yeah. Thirsty work. We're all like, oh, like <laughs> some juice. <laughs> I know. Put Jade standing where there was some speedy beat. Like this is a joke. You get chips and I get this. So I got some iron boo to match my hands. <laughs> on Stevie's face. <laughs> this is um, natural. We're just getting to watch some people now, which is quite nice. T takes the pressure off. Like, because I'm opened up, by the way, I like feel the wind on my sweat. Oh, it's oh, quite cold, oh, actually. Yes. It's quite cold. Oh, I love how people are coming to the fence, it's very chilled. Yeah. Where I'm like, brrr, like flying. <laughs> She's happy now. Oh, oh, oh. Have a chip. Oh. <laughs> Trip at the back of the throat. You know, like that. You know, like when you've like been running or something and you breathe and it's like. <coughs> yeah, it like, in the back. Yeah. <coughs> so. Jeez. That's happening to me, yeah. even though I haven't run. Wow. Mm. Me and Elise have already eaten. Oh my god. So that was a bit of an abrupt end, unfortunately, just because Jade and Blondie are obsessed with each other. But me and Cameron just took a nice little stroll home and got a wee Starbucks to enjoy because we were. Falling asleep after a long day. Actually, you don't have much of an excuse. I was the one that was riding and all that, you know? So, very stressful for me. Very stressful to make sure that I do well. You know, Academy sets all these um, high expectations of me and sometimes hard to live up to. It really is. <laughs> and we've just arrived back and Casper is chilling. Oh, horse in the way. Casper's like, ha ha blondie, I don't need to do hard work anymore. I'm just sunbathing. I actually can't feel my legs anymore. <laughs> oh my God, unhappy horse. I went on a jog yesterday for the first time this year and I done 3K and my legs were dying already this morning. And now obviously after the car journey, they've totally seized up from riding as well. Ooh. Makes me think that Blondie's gonna be sore tomorrow as well. Bless her. Hard work, all this. You got a friend in me. You got a friend in me. Oh, Blondie, where you go? Where are you going? Ah, oh, this isn't working out as well as I thought it would. <laughs> She's so fed up of our nonsense. You got a friend in me. 
you got a friend in me. Kitties. Just getting Casper in now to keep his sister company. Guess she deserves a little bit of company now. Having her tea and everything. And yeah, she's been such a good girl today. Apart from when she was a wee bit upset when she saw Jade. <laughs> Not upset even, just like happy, but in a really irritating way. <laughs> but yeah, um, Blondie's absolutely incredible. Um, not actually had a chance to like fully update the vlog from my perspective. I think I've just been like enjoying the day because it's been so long since I've actually been able to be like stress free and like actually just enjoy myself and remind myself like why I do it and why I love it so much and how amazing my pony is. Um, yeah, because I've obviously had quite a difficult time recently and today just was maybe like over the moon. Um, so nice to actually be able to enjoy it again and just like have all your worries put aside and in the back of your mind and just like know everything's actually okay. My pony's okay. And yeah, so, so happy. Really, really need, needed that confidence boost today. Oh, that is some messy hair. I think she's happy to be home and relaxing next to her bro. Hey, baby girl. That was a lot for her after like everything that's happened. If you've watched the Blondie update vlog, um, we've definitely been through a rough time. So yeah, that was not easy of her. And that's how I didn't have much expectations of her. Oh my goodness, you cheeky women. Um, but no, she, she was absolutely incredible as usual. We have been sitting watching some cross country. <laughs> um, and yeah, time to put her back on the trailer and head home. <laughs> She's been amazing and she's so chill standing here on her own. Fab, especially when she's seen Blondie because she was very excited about that, weren't you? I love you, I love you. So proud of you. So that is me home. Oh my goodness, look at the actual state of me. I look like I've been dragged through edge backwards. I washed my hair yesterday. <laughs> Need a shower. Um, but yeah, I think this describes my state accurately. I am so tired. <laughs> <laughs> and sore and everything but I am so happy she was amazing um I feel like I learned a lot today like at Glen Eagles like she took me around everything but like I still did ride her but like see like when you're out on the cross country course you never have a moment to not ride like you have to ride every single fence like you can't get complacent even if it's the last jump or something like that do you know what I mean so um yeah I really need to work on that like making sure every single fence even ones I'm not scared of are, um, I'm riding towards them and I'm confident at them and stuff like that so it gives her confidence and my lines are smack bang and we need to practice cantering through water to keep our momentum because we totally just like flopped to like a halt in that water and there was no way we were getting over it and the line was a bit dodgy too because I was like trying to get him to canter and I was like we just kind of went wiggly babyish um yeah so but the fact that when I've repre represented her to both those fences that she had a wee oh uh, um she was absolutely fine. I still can't believe the age of her. Like, she's so young and she's just flying around. Like, the confidence change in her in such a short time is, like, mind-blowing. So it's so exciting to see what she's going to be like when she's older. Or even, like, later on in the season. But yeah, I feel like, finally, like, thinking about it now, I feel excited at the thought of being in the Starbucks again. Like, I feel, like, I'm quite glad that she had those wee runouts today because, like, now I know that's the worst that's going to happen. Like, like what am I worried about like that wasn't that bad and we represent representing she was fine like do you know what I mean like that's what I'm scared of like her stopping but like she was absolutely fine do you know what I mean and it was my fault like and if Jade stops I'll know it's my fault in the future <laughs> um so yeah thank you so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed and it's not gonna be long till our next cross-country one because I'm excited to be back out there already <laughs> see you later bye <laughs>